On Tuesday, water began to rush over the levee, and officials warned that it could fail at any moment. So this is an extraordinary situation. Look at this big bullseye here, Steph. 15 right. plus but inches of rain. Six states saw 10 to 15 inches of rain. So a flash flood emergency in Arkansas as several levees along the Black River fail. Today they have identified nine levee breaches. We've been looking at this for the past couple of days, and it's still going on. Unfortunately, it's going to continue right into the weekend. And we got problems people and not only do we have problems we got problems on top of our problems on top of our problems stay cool this is a thor news presentation thor news presents this is the black river which has been out of its banks it's actually reached historic record cresting by about 10 feet now this is a look this is a tributary of the arkansas river this is another river that is suffering in missouri the merrimack river continues to swell now 27 feet above flood stage it's damaged nearly 200 homes rivers creeks and streams all above flood level from parts of missouri arkansas and louisiana the levees that protect the city have been breached all of that water is flowing into towns like Pocahontas. Watch as this cabin slams right into a bridge. Oh my God. So we got like major emergency flash flooding in five states. I think it, we got rivers 10 feet past record levels and climbing. And because it is happening in rice, cake and corn states like Missouri, Arkansas, Indiana, Oklahoma, Illinois, Louisiana, it ain't getting no press and not many people care. A lot of people don't know. This is from April 25th and notice all the greenery. I want you to focus in these black areas. This is the Mississippi River. So mm -hmm. those are bodies of water where you see the black on the map. That's right. Now let's advance to what it looks like now. And you're going to see that area just expand. Look at all that down here, Pocahontas, where we had the levee breach, Poplar Bluff. Look at all that blue that all just mm -hmm. fills in. Check out this on Highway 21. This is what it looks like normally. And let's go ahead and advance and show you. Look at that. So all that water spilling in right in between. When you watch the flooding, it's all the water pouring in just between. Oh the two there. And so we took you back more than seven days now because this is the third round of rain yeah. that we're dealing with. And over the last two weeks, more rain is in the forecast. We've been looking at it all week long. Now, some of these places in the flood zones, we're starting to see levee breaches, numerous ones we had yesterday. They're looking at 10 plus inches of rain over the past seven days. Over 100 river gauges have flooded along the Mississippi, Missouri, and Arkansas rivers. This is the area that will continue to have problems with flooding. And I do want to make a note, the major rivers such as the Missouri and the Mississippi, we're going to continue to have flooding along those rivers for weeks to come. Now, here's a look at the rainfall through Friday. We are not done yet. The heaviest rain is going to be further up to the north. So Indianapolis, Fort Wayne, even over to Detroit, you could pick up two to three inches before this is all said and done on Friday. Okay, I am now caught in an endless loop of weather videos. And each one I do is more important than the last. Seek higher ground. So here we go again. If it's happening in a galaxy, then toys all over here. Hurricanes, solar flares, planet X. How humanity's gonna destroy itself at each other's necks. Yeah, I don't know if you know this. No, I don't know if you know this. with next week with a new storm coming into the plain states this is a weird weather pattern we're in